Yeah, LaFleur Nation, what it do, man? Y'all already know the vibes, man. It's your boy Def, and we back with another daily banger, man. But before we hop into today's video, man, y'all already know what to do, man. Go ahead and drop a like on the video right now. Go ahead, drop a like. Let's get this video to 30 likes. If you're new to the channel, man, do not forget to hit that subscribe button for your boy, man. We're on the road to 3K. And make sure you turn your post notifications on, man, for the daily content every single day. And I'm going to put my Twitch up right now. Go ahead and follow that Twitch. And uh, if you didn't know, I stream every single night on my Twitch. So, man, you don't want to miss those. Hey, them, them streams be lit, y'all. I'm trying to tell y'all. Music booming. All that good stuff, bro. Great vibes, man. Sound requests. All that good stuff. You don't want to miss out on that, man. But let's go ahead and jump straight into the video. Yeah, if you're hearing this, man, you got car lacking, man. Make sure you hit that like button and make sure you hit that subscribe button. All right, y'all. As y'all can see from the thumbnail and the title, man, I got the rarest demigod point guard build in the game for y'all, bro. Let me give y'all a little rundown on this build, bro. It gets contact dunks. It shoots consistently. It can dribble. And it can play defense, bro. This build is, I ain't gonna lie, bro. It's hands down, like, one of the top guard builds on this game, bro. This this build gets everything, literally. But um, let's go ahead and jump straight into it, man. The position you want to rock with a point guard, whichever hand you want. And you know I'm rocking with the one piece. Let me go ahead and take that football number off real quick. For the skill breakdown, aka the pie chart, man, you want to rock with the one that has majority slashing and some shooting. Not the half-half. The one that has the majority blue and then some green, more green than yellow and red. Considering that we do not have uh, playmaking in our build, we do not get Hall of Fame playmaking badges, man. Make sure you rock with the fastest physical profile. Going with 85 speed, 85 acceleration, 52 strength, and 72 vertical. Alright, now for these attribute upgrades, man. Make sure you put down exactly what I put here, bro, so you can get the best possible outcome for this build. And if you need to, man, if you need to uh, skip through the video or pause the video, any of that good stuff, man, feel free to. All right, now for your close shot, you want to go ahead and max out at 87, max your drop and layup, max your dunk, and then bring your standing dunk up to the 38, and you'll get 17 finishing badges. For shooting, you want to go ahead and max your mid-range, max your three-point, and then max your free throw, and that'll leave you with 16 shooting badges. For playmaking, you want to bring your, uh, bring your pass accuracy all the way up, Bring your ball handling all the way up, and then bring your post moves up to a 44. And that'll leave you with 15 playmaking badges. For defense, you want to skip over interior, max your perimeter, max your lateral, max your steal, bring your block up to a 36, and then put the rest on your defensive rebound. And that'll leave you with six defensive badges. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. That's slick. That's slick. A lot of badges. Man. If I could do do my math real quick. That's 54 badges in total, y'all, bro. That's a, a, that's a lot of badges. I ain't gonna lie. For the body shape, man, if you ain't rocking with Burley, man, what are you doing? Make sure you rock with Burley, bro. Burley allows you, listen, the game's animation based. Burley allows you to get the best animations in the game. Low buys, uh, play better defense, more steals, more dunks, all that good stuff, bro. Make sure you rock with Burley. For the height, you want to go 6'4 with this build. It's perfect, bro. I'm going to talk about this build at 99. You have to grind this build. Let me put that out there. You got to grind this build. But the height, 6'4. The weight, you want to drop the weight all the way down to the sweet spot at 178, where you do not lose anything. You do not lose um, your speed. Like, your speed is the same thing at 175, but you lose strength. So, you want to bring it back up to 178, and you don't lose nothing. You feel me? Y'all picking up what I'm putting down. <laughs> But uh, um, wingspan, you want to bring it up to 83.2. Now, why, why bring it up? Because look, this build, obviously, you have to grind it, bro. You have to get to 99 with this build so you can speed boost. And uh, I believe contact dunks is at 98 overall. <clears throat> when we look at this build at a 99 perspective. But hold on, let me talk about, look, off rip, man, we getting all the layup packages. Don't put that out there. You ain't got to worry about that, y'all. You getting all the little layup packages, all the NBA player layup packages, all that good stuff. But at 99, y'all, our layup's gonna jump up to a 95. Our dunk is gonna jump up to a 86. Contact dunks. Yes, sir, man. Contact dunks. Your mid range is gonna jump up to an 83. Your three point shot is gonna jump up to an 81, which is perfect, bro, because listen, 
listen, you're going to be able to shoot with this build. And that, a lot of builds can't shoot this year if they ain't have all of, if they don't have Hall of Fame shooting. So that's perfect, y'all. Your ball handle is gonna jump up to an 85. So at 99, you will unlock every single dribble move in the game, bro. That's perfect. <clears throat> Our defense perimeter is gonna jump up to an 81. Our lateral quickness is gonna jump up to a 79. Our steals is gonna jump up to an 85, which is crazy because we're not even like nothing in our build is really defense like that. So 85 steal on this build is crazy. Um, our defensive rebound, just to put that in there, man, is gonna jump up to a 69. But the physicals on this build, bro. You know, at 99, we think about all the attributes on the left, man. We think about plus four for every single one of them. But when we look at physicals, y'all, that's plus eight. You get the plus four from your 99. And then you get the plus four from your Gatorade, or if you have gym rank. So that's plus eight for our physical. So our speed is jumping up to a 95. Our acceleration is jumping up to a 95. Our strength is jumping up to a 52. And our vertical is jumping up to an 80. That's crazy, huh? <laughs> this build is a demi gun. I ain't gonna lie to you. <clears throat> With this build, man, we get we get four takeover options, y'all. We get slashing, we get shot creating, we get playmaking, and we get sharp. Now look, slashing is an amazing badge for this. I mean, an amazing takeover for this build because we get contact dunks. But I'm gonna stay away from slashing because this the, um, the shooting on this build is not 90s. So I want to choose sharp shooting takeover for this build because every time you get takeover, it boosts your shot over and over and over. And you know. Sharp takeover is definitely OP this year, bro. If you didn't know, bro. Fading threes, deep threes, bro. It's, it's a little bit crazy. But I'm going to rock with sharp take, man. Slash and take is, the I would say, the second best takeover for this build because you do get contact dunks, which is you can go crazy with it. Um, shot creating take is a good take, but I'm not really a fader. Playmaking take, another great take if they fix the angle breakers, bro. You feel me? But sharp takeover, man. I'm rocking with the sharp takeover, man. Y'all can pick what y'all want, man. Y'all, it's really a preference thing, but the build name is Slasher, bro. But y'all see the numbers on this build is ridiculous. Go ahead, put some badges on it, man. Let's, let's go get right. All right, we're gonna we're gonna rock with Contact Finisher, Slithery Finisher, Relentless Finisher, Acrobat, and not. I'm tripping, y'all. I didn't even put on fancy footwork. <laughs> hey, if y'all didn't know, man, fancy footwork, Hall of Fame, Slither Finisher, Hall of Fame. Them two badges right here, bro. And contact finishes, the, the uh, three musketeer badges, y'all. The, the little trio. If you do um, Euro steps with these badges on, bro, they're going to miss by far, bro. It's ridiculous, bro. Literally, bro. It's literally ridiculous. Like, Euro steps are OP. I don't know if y'all played 2K19, but the Euro steps, that's how they are this year, bro. They're crazy OP. For shooting, we got 16 in the thing. So we're going to rock with Range Extender, Hot Zone Hunter, Green Machine, Volume Shooter, uh, snap. <laughs> Difficult Shots, and we're going to put the last one on Clutch Shooter. For playmaking, we got 15. So we're gonna quick first step, handles for days, diamond, bell out, and unpluckable. Perfect little badge setup, man. Even if you want to take this off, bro, you can take bell out down and unpluckable down and put floor general for your teammates, bro. That's simple. Bell out, bell out really does work on bronze this year for some reason, bro. You do not need it that high. It's too crazy. Alright, defensive badges, man. It really depends on what you're playing, bro. If you're playing twos, man, clamps, pick dodger. If you're playing threes, you're not really guarding the ball, man. Interceptor, you can put on. You can keep clamps on. Yeah, you can keep clamps on for whenever you're guarding your person, but <clears throat> it really comes down to your preference. Thing. I play a lot of twos, so I'm gonna keep pick dodge room. But if y'all boys enjoyed this video, man, let me know down in the comment section, man. And uh, if y'all wanna see any future videos, man, let me know down below as well. But uh, what was I gonna say, man? Make sure y'all drop a like on the video going crazy with the daily concert every single day and i appreciate y'all boys man when the road this 3k i already know the vibes man being your boy duffy if i see y'all boys in my next video on my next stream i'm gonna see y'all boys when i see y'all and i'm out